hi everyone welcome to my channel today i am doing a, a book haul video i just happened to see a book sale near to my place and i just went in browsing for some books in the children's section for my son and i found real good pressures at a very good rate they were selling books by the kilo so i have a massive haul of books and uh, i just want to share them with you all right so the first book that i picked was it uh it's for my toddler it's a, all about eyes nose fingers and toes it's a hardback book and uh, it's got lovely illustrations and uh, they have these four uh, lines with rhymes and um, it's really fun to read with your child and they have it for all the parts of the body so then this one is by julia donaldson and it's regal and roar and it's got all these colorful uh, artwork pictures and uh, really cool rhymes that you can read with your son or daughter then this is young mcdonald had a farm this is my son's favorite rhyme so far and he just loves listening to me sing it and this is a variation on that and it's all about uh, the young mcdonald who has a farm and instead of animals in the farm it's all about all the uh, vehicles that he uses the tractor and uh, uh, the truck and the crane and uh, stuff like that so it's all about uh, machines and their sounds so I think it's a very good uh, like it's a very good addition to our collection and then this book is all about uh, tall, short, big, small, opposites and it's all uh, shown in the way of pictures and there, there are no stories, uh, there's no story, there's, there are no sentences, nothing to explain. You can see the picture and uh, just make up a story for your child. The only words you would see in the book are these uh, word bubbles and uh, you can just simply make up whatever story you want so it's a pretty thick book and it's a real nice one then i personally love this very much and this is all about mommies and their babies so again mommy huge mommy hairy then mommy spiny mommy scary so you it's all about each animal and how their child looks and uh, what are their main features and what they do how they walk and uh, whether they roll and whatnot so i totally love this book for my son i think we are really gonna enjoy reading it then uh, this here is a boat book i like it because it was shaped a little bit different and it's a story about a dog and uh, it's a pretty simple book with lovely artwork and uh, not much of text so i think my son will like this then this here is uh, they are the activity books and i know this is a bit uh, advanced for my toddler but uh, it's all find the items in the page 
so each page has a uh, box like this with the items that your child can pick out so it's all on uh, frozen and i thought maybe it could be a good gift for someone else or maybe my child could use it when he's older so then uh, i got as bun's first coloring book and it's again quite pretty and i really like that it although i bought it at a uh, book by kilo kind of sale it is a brand new book the same goes for this it's not being used at all so and uh, then this is again an activity book spot the zebra at the zoo and just question answers interactive book with lots of animals colorful pictures and it's just lovely so then again this is about a treasure hunt and it has a, a short storyline along with that you have all these uh, activity kind of things interactive pages where you can like discuss ask questions and ask your child to point out and stuff like that then uh, this is the husband lift the flap questions and answers and uh, i was really happy to find this uh in this bookstore and uh, i got it at a very very cheap rate but the book is in very good condition and the flaps are still intact and uh, it's like it's hardly being used it was just a little dirty and i just made sure that i uh, wiped all the books clean with a wet tissue and then dried them and now they are ready to go in his bookshelf so uh, then i also uh, found these the very hungry caterpillar i know it's a classic and it's like almost every parent has it but uh, i hadn't bought it till now and i saw it here and i thought why not let's give it a try let's see whether my son likes it or not so this book then this is a bit of a shiny book it's all about uh, different kinds of trucks digger tipper truck what it does my child is obsessed with cars and uh, just you know vehicles in general he loves to play with them and uh, he has plenty of these trucks so i thought it might be a good book for him then i found this book although this is in a bad shape the book itself is in a pretty good condition and uh, out of the 10 magnets only these two are missing we have the rest so i thought it's still a good deal so now starting with the actual treasures uh, i found this book tiddler and it is in great condition uh, it's got a lovely cover and uh, it is a lovely story with very very beautiful artwork i will be doing individual reviews on all of these books so you can check out the book at that time for now i'm just showing you what books i've purchased then i got this one safely through the night and it's got uh, sparkly glitter on all the pages and though the story follows the character who is a girl i still thought it might be a good uh, story to read to my son i could just probably change out the character and just swap it with his name and he'd be happy listening to me so it's again a beautiful story about an angel who watches over the girl while she sleeps at night then julia donaldson again tyrannosaurus strip and this is a 
lovely story again with really cute artwork and it's very very interesting i am eager to read this to my son then i found this book it is a super tattoo the veggies symbol and it's about like the veggies are superheroes and uh, it's just a story about them trying saving the world <laughs> kind of thing so very very cute artwork and very colorful and uh, i think my son might like this then this is a real treasure mixed up fairy tales he has to be a little older before he can actually enjoy this but uh, till then it's still fun to read and you can just turn the pages and goldilocks had a jealous stepmother with a talking mirror and moved in with seven dwarves before being poisoned by a beautiful swine so you have like four different stories and you can mix and match to create your own stories so this is hilarious and uh, i really am waiting for my son to grow up so i can uh, read this with him and he can understand and enjoy this book then we have little lost panda and it is a very simple story but uh, the artwork is just beautiful and it's just so cute then uh, if you hold my hand this is about a uh, mommy and child story or a daddy and child story however you might want to read it and it's got very very beautiful artwork the book itself is not in mint condition it has been used clearly and some pages are a bit loose but i plan to like uh, stick it restore it and then i can use it for myself then uh, my monster temper truck and this book is really cool the artwork is so cute and it is so inviting my son loved it when he looked at the shop itself and there are these nice cutouts and peep through holes and it's a really cute story and the last page kind of has um, it excuse me yeah it opens up like this to create a big picture yeah, so very pretty i love this book then uh, who's been eating my porridge again uh, it's a simple story with the uh, real nice artwork again and I just thought it might be a nice addition to a collection then we have Monstersaurus it's again a book about how this boy creates uh, a monster and uh, very very interesting artwork specifically uh, these kind of books i think boys really like them so then this again is a uh, very beautiful story lovely artwork and very very interesting and engaging story when your toddler understands what you're reading to him i think this would be a great way to uh, you know great story to read before night time and then there's a line in my complex and again it is such a cute book such cute artwork and uh, very very hilarious and a very interesting story then this book is a treasure again so this entire book has only pictures of dogs the entire story 
is shown in pictures there are no words no sentences no nothing so you have to make up the story as you read the book so i think this would be great even for a toddler or even a younger child because the artwork is so amazing and the back look at the tail then little red riding hood i bought this i already have three books uh, having the same story uh, one from husband and two just other random ones and they're all board books and i bought this because i fell in love with the artwork uh, the book again is not in very good condition but just look at the artwork it is so pretty and uh, it's just amazing I bought it just because I fell in love with the pictures. So, and then this is the best book that I've purchased today, and it's got lovely artwork, short stories that will interest toddlers, and very very relatable stories. The pictures are great. The story is great. Just everything is great about this book, and there's so much you can, uh, you know, share and experience with your son or your daughter. Uh, this is a boy book, so it's uh, about a son, but uh, it's a great book, and I'm really glad to have bought this. So I purchased uh, about thirty books in all today. and um, i spent only 50 rupees per book so all in all it's uh, an amazing haul and i am happy to have shared this with you so uh, thanks for watching please do like share and subscribe for more videos in the future and uh, stay tuned to my channel i'll be uh, uploading individual reviews of uh, each book So thanks for watching bye bye